What's up guys, it is Will here, back again, and tonight I'm here to talk about the InArt Batman Robert Pattinson 1 6 scale figure from InArt, like I mentioned. That said, guys, there's been an update. InArt has posted an update, they've posted comparisons. We want to see what's going on here. So let's see what they said. Updates on the InArt, the Batman, the Batman and Bruce Wayne 1 6 scale collectible figure. After the last release, InArt has made some minor changes to the figures based on the original film and photographs of the actor from multiple angles. They did some reconsideration on some of the head sculpts. The Batman head sculpt update, Bruce Wayne head sculpt update, combat armor, the cape and helmet update, cape length and helmet head sculpt shape. Okay, so they made some changes. Let's take a look at the changes. Okay. So looking at this at face value, I think this is a slight improvement. I don't know that I see a major improvement here, but I definitely see an improvement, which is great. And really, what more could you ask for, right? InArt is improving on the figure before the release. Hot Toys did this too. I love it. I love that these companies are putting their best foot forward and producing the best product that they can possibly release. From this angle, it actually looks even better. It also is a little bit slightly different lighting, so it could just be that. The mouth expression looks slightly different. Maybe it's just the angle, but the hair looks pretty much the same, although the head sculpt shape looks slightly different. I still don't think this head sculpt is a 10, but damn, is it good? I think it's a nine. I'm gonna give it a nine. The Bruce Wayne looks much better. I really think this looks like a nice update here. And you can see a slightly different expression on this Bruce Wayne figure. Maybe it's just be the, it could just be the different eyes. They position them slightly differently for this. But from this angle, it looks a lot better. I think in hand, this is going to look really, really nice. I want to watch the Batman again because honestly, this figure is even tempting me now. And I didn't even love the Batman. I always thought it was like a pretty good film, but this looks like a really, really good figure. I gave the Batman like an eight, but I probably need to watch it again. So I probably will. I think this is a nice update. I'm liking that InArt is doing this. And I think guys keep giving InArt your feedback on the bases, on the head sculpts, on the tailoring, on everything involved with these figures, because they're going for like sort of a high end line. So you want it to be as good as possible and they need to know these things. So if they don't know, how would they really know to improve it? So I think criticism and feedback, as long as it's productive and healthy is a really good thing for in arm. Respectful uh, feedback is also really important. So to me, that's what I would say at the end of the day is really crucial. And I'm glad that in art is listening and making changes. Hot Toys does this too. Uh, when we get rowdy enough and make some noise, respectfully, of course. And Hot Toys like, okay, okay, we hear you guys. We hear you guys. We're going to make some changes. We're going to make Cyborg. So, yeah, there's a, lot of, there's a lot of good feedback out there that really leads to productive things, like making a great figure like Cyborg. So, that said, really like this update for InArt. The Batman's hair looks a little bit better. The head sculpt looks a little bit better. Could just be the styling. But overall, this is a good update. I want to hear what you guys think in the comments below. And... Yeah, which in-art figure are you most excited for? For me, you know, it's got to be Pennywise, but that Aragorn is pretty dope too. Can't wait to see what they do with the Game of Thrones line. But overall, yeah, I'm happy with this. I think this is going to be a nice thing for collectors. So for those who really want the Batman looking at you, Riley, I think this is going to be great. And I'm happy for all you collectors out there that are going to be picking this up. That's it, guys. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Peace out. That's all from me for now. Bye.